Another mode of philosophy is called utilitarianism, and it believes that an individual should do the greatest good for the greater number of people. It is like a cost and benefit analysis. Which one is the best option that will result in the least amount of cost? This theory is divided in two parts, act and rule. The main difference between the two is that act considers only the present actions without thinking of the future consequences, while rule will look at the future and how your choice will benefit more people in the long run. Now, imagine that you have a group assignment with five students and that you found out that one of them plagiarized the essay. What would you do? According to art utilitarianism, you would go to the professor and tell her about his academic dishonesty. This way, you and the other three students will not fail the assignment and therefore will be doing the greatest good for the greater number of people. However, this decision takes into consideration the present without considering that he might fail the course due to plagiarism. On the other hand, rule utilitarianism will suggest that you approach your group member and explain to him why plagiarism is wrong and how to avoid it. This will prevent him from cheating in the future and for the whole group to get a good grade on this assignment. People might act and react to different scenarios in real life. This is why it is important to study the different philosophy and to know how to apply them in real life. Please take a moment to share this video and help others to do the right thing. Created using Powtoon.